No, sziasztok! Elhoztam egy legdurvább videót, most egy picit bele pörgettem, mert itten csak hadogálás van. Most én megmutatom nektek, hogy az az ember, hogy összeszartam magát a, a, a egy olyan elhagyatott, vagy iskola, vagy ház igatlanba, nem tudom, de nézzétek meg ezt a videót, hogy kinek van a legjobb hülyesége ennek bemenni. Na, az biztos, hogy összeszartam volna magamban, hogy én bementem volna a foglalkásba, videóra vettem volna ezt a furcsa hülyeségeket, és nézzük meg, hogy mit ábrázál. Gmail.com Something in the building Korean ghost hunt live streamer Michael from the YouTube channel Dosha Michael is back with another exploration of a creepy abandoned place. This time the ghost hunter explores several buildings of a long abandoned village. Now Michael doesn't share why the village has been left empty and abandoned, but one can only imagine all the life and death that have left a mark on the decaying buildings. Michael is broadcasting on a live stream to his fans as he ventures inside the building he will be exploring. As his viewers watch live, things quickly become truly bizarre. Ő ebbe be is ment, ebbe a kásba, és nem tudom mi után mutatnak ezek. Doors on both sides of the creepy hallway swing open and shut. Michael's a bit freaked out, but he carefully continues on to investigate. Az biztosan kezd nem hinni el, hogy mi folyik. Rendesen meg van a rémbővel, akkor minek megy be, hogy fél? Akkor minek megy be, hogy fél? Egyáltalán is. Hagyj már az jó! Most be vagy kell itt fel, hogy sem. When Michael finds himself a bit confined in a small cramped room, he decides he has just had enough of the creepy doors and makes a run for it. After gathering his courage, the ghost hunter decides to explore the main building of the abandoned village. Whatever present seems to be haunting the small town, it seems it is not done with Michael just yet. Nem tudom, hogy ki ez a fiú, de 
nagyon ez is félős figyeljetek ránéz a az ablakba vagy játszom vagy nem tudom hogy van ez vagy valóságos -e. mert ne figyeljétek a az ablakot az emeletet figyeljétek hogy mit csinál hogy jár Figyeljetek, lenéz a védő, magából a széget, figyelj, majd fogd az emeletet, figyeljétek, ott a kettőt, na, ott, 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 ott van, egy fekete árnyék, ott van, na, na, ez, két darab fekete árnyék van, de most megkísérelje az, hogy bemegyen a ház, a lakásba, ennyi csinál csak, vagy, vagy tudom, Nevet egyet vagy sikolyt. És kész. Ja, ott nézzétek majd a fotó végén. Egy ajtó, egy ajtó ki fog nyílni, és egy feket állni, fel fog tenni a másik ablakonál. Én nőhelyben ott hagytam volna a ezeket. De mindenki a... No, es. Igual. After hearing strange footsteps coming from the second floor, Michael quickly runs outside and looks up at the windows of the second floor balcony. He is shocked when he sees two dark shadow-like apparitions that seem to be walking on the second floor. Gathering his courage, Michael goes up to the second floor to investigate, but he is quickly scared away when one of the apparitions makes a terrifying appearance at the door at the end of the hallway. Now, usually the ghost hunter will charge forward towards the apparition and try to record the apparition. Michael seems to believe he isn't entirely alone at the creepy abandoned village. He believes that some real person or people might be messing with him. Scared that he might be dealing with a real group of people up to no good, his live chat audience actually calls the police and Michael, understandably, just decides to get out of there. So what do you think Michael caught on camera? Is it something paranormal? Could it have been real people up to no good just messing with him? Or is it all just an elaborate hoax? You decide. Uninvited. This next TikTok video might not be something related to the paranormal, but it is certainly something absolutely terrifying. Hannah Viverette is recording a TikTok video of her dancing in her living room when the unthinkable happens. tries to break in through Hannah's balcony door and she makes a run for it. Now before you think this might be a TikTok hoax, I can assure you that this video is 100% real. The man who entered Hannah's apartment was 36 year old Angel Rodriguez Gomez. Shortly after the events in this video, he was arrested and charged with burglary, assault, stalking, and destruction of property. 
Multiple news outlets picked up this chilling story and Hannah shows in an interview how the man climbed two stories to reach her apartment balcony. Right now I'm standing directly in front of my apartment and the second story balcony right here is where he had entered. Hannah explains that this wasn't the first time <laughs> seen that man. He recognized him almost immediately uh, yeah. based off yeah, of his like clothing. Um, and now I've seen that face and the outfit around my apartment complex many, many occasions. It turns out that this seemingly disturbed man was actually one of Hannah's neighbors, and he had apparently been watching her closely for a while. All things considered, the situation could have possibly ended much worse if Hannah had not headed for her front door immediately. She is now looking to move from her apartment as she rightfully says that she no longer feels safe there. So, how would you handle this terrifying situation? Would you run? Would you scream? Or just what would you do? Who are you? Who are you? Please get out. Please get out. Yeah, we don't have time on the Yes. Who are you? Please get out of my apartment right now. Please come in. The faceless man. There's one over there. Chamos and his friend Jota go to investigate the local urban legend of the quote faceless man in a small town in the Brazilian countryside. Their investigation takes them to a factory that has been abandoned for over 10 years. Before the factory was closed, workers often claimed that they would see the terrifying apparition of a man with a horribly disfigured face. Factory. Whenever they would pursue him, he would just disappear into thin air. Cut to a few years later. A terrible unexplained fire occurs at the factory, claiming the lives of many workers. After this, the alleged paranormal activity seems to intensify. The hardworking employees would hear unexplained noises and terrifying screams. It is said that after many complaints from terrified factory workers who refused to enter the building, that the work site was moved to a completely different location. Today, what was once a large thriving factory is now nothing more than rubble and ruins. When YouTuber Shamos and team member Jota begin their investigation, they are immediately beginning to feel like they are being watched. Aqui é a sala do pesadelo, aqui ó, já. Aqui ó. Aqui ó. E olha só, cara. Pesadelo escrito na parede, cara. Did you see it? The two investigators are completely unaware that a creepy pale face seems to be watching them from one of the windows. When I just turn the camera back to the same window, the face is gone. Having no idea what they just captured, they continue on to explore more of the abandoned property. And things only get creepier. <laughs>
Ó, oh, olha só. Aqui em cima o teto aqui, Jota. Que, que que é isso aí, cara? Que barulho que é isso aí, cara? Jota, 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 vai, 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 vem pra cá. Eu vi alguma coisa ali, cara. Aonde, cara? Eu vi alguma Onde? coisa ali no buraco, Onde? velho. Ali eu vi alguma coisa ali no buraco. Aqui, cara. Aonde chamas? Onde tu viu, cara? cara. O que, que tu viu, cara? Cara, uma cabeça espiando. Uma cabeça, cara. Uma cabeça espiando. Cara. Não tem como aumentar na tá? Não pode, cara. Jota, juro pra eu E cara, eu juro pela minha vida, cara. Tem alguma coisa ali, cara. Ali, cara, ali, cara. The bizarre face appears again. And this time the two investigators see it with their own eyes. When Shamos and Jota check the room, there's no one there. Understandably, they are a bit freaked out. They prepare for the worst as they make their way through the ruins of the factory. They look for any signs of someone Csak tisztán mert nem tudják a kodóta. Ott van mellettetek. Ei, eu tô te ouvindo, hein? Tem barulho? Eu tô te ouvindo. Quem tá aí? Cuida aí, Olha lá, olha lá, cara. Vaza, vaza, Jota, corre. Corre, cara. A strange face peers out at them from around the corner. The two explorers are terrified. They decide to make a run for it. All of the creepy faces they have captured throughout the night seem to have no visible features. It seems as if they might have actually encountered the local legend of the quote, faceless man. So, what do you think? Did the two friends capture evidence of an extreme Thanks so much for watching. My Instagram is here. My Twitter is here. And oh, look at that. My TikTok. See you next week. Na sziasztok, ennyi volt a videó, köszönöm szépen, hogy nézték a videó, 19 voltam, és küldjetek, vagyis ne küldjetek, hogy sziasztok.